I took this girl to dinner, and I heard that women like it when you order for them. So I was like, I'll have this special, and she's not going to eat anything tonight. <laughs> a lot of the time, I think I have a really good idea, but then it turns out it's actually not a good idea. Like, I was really hungry, and I wanted a personal chef, but I couldn't afford one. So I had the idea to start a business that's like a timeshare thing for personal chefs, <laughs> where a bunch of people pool their money and you just use the chef when you need one. And I was really excited, and then I realized that I just invented the restaurant. <laughs> when people say that Superman is faster than a speeding bullet, do you really have to use the word speeding? I just saw this guy who's faster than a bullet. Oh, you mean like a bullet I gently toss across the room? No, a speeding bullet. I'm sorry, I should have clarified. My parents are getting kind of old and sick. I think I'm gonna have to put them in a nursing home. I feel really bad though, because I live with my parents, and I don't want to live in a nursing home. But one thing I learned recently is when you go on an airplane, don't hide your weed in a gun. <laughs> Everyone at work thinks I'm crazy because I come to work every day wearing a spacesuit. But you dress for the job you want, not the job you have. I went to this massage parlor, and there's a really embarrassing moment when I asked for a happy ending, and I found out they only give legitimate massages at West Valley Hospital Chiropractic Clinic. But I'm jealous of kids today. It's so much easier to masturbate now than it used to be. When I was a kid, you had to go find the Sears catalog, go to the go to the lingerie section. Now the internet, I just go to my computer, go online, go right to Sears.com. <laughs> Today was a sad day. I had to pull the plug on my grandmother because I really need the outlet for my laptop. <laughs> I was reading this STD pamphlet and it said that when you sleep with someone, you're also sleeping with every person they've ever had sex with. If that's true, I've had sex with zero people. <laughs> they say you're not supposed to go to the grocery store when you're hungry, but I ran out of food like a week ago, and every day I get hungrier and hungrier. <laughs> My mom always says she wishes I was never born. But I don't think that's true, because if I was never born, she'd have a 26-year-old man living inside her uterus. I went to one of those police auctions where they sell everything they confiscate from criminals. It was really cool. For $200, I got a kilo of coke and a kidnapped girl. I've been married for two years. My wife didn't tell me until this week that she's a prostitute. <laughs> and then, just when I'm finally starting to be okay with it, she gave me a bill for $85,000. <laughs> right, thank you.